know that sometimes we worry so much about what people would say that we do not know what God tells us to do. Our worry is not with God. Our worry is what people would say or people would think. I've often said, and I've reached a point in this country where I've said, I mean, you do, they're going to talk. You don't do, they're still going to talk. You're in between, the, you're, you're, you're in the gray, gray, grayish area, they're still going to talk. You're in the total red, they're going to talk. You're in the total black, 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 black. Oh so what are you going to do? And no matter where you go, they're going to be saying some things and things about you that you will not like, you will not appreciate. And for heaven's sake, if you follow them, you're staying in your house and you will not come out. Too many Grenadians are living their life through other people. They know how to tell you what to do, but they themselves can't do what they are telling you what to do. They know how to tell you how to live. They tell you what you're doing wrong. How do they come and tell you what you're doing right? They always know what you're doing wrong. They always know how to do it right. Ask them to do it the way they say it should be done. It's not mine. It's yours. So let me tell you this. Stick to what God has called you to do. Release yourself from people and stick on to God. Release yourself from people holding you back. A lot of you are being held back by people. Held back by your friends. Held back by your husband, by your wife. Held back by your neighbors. Held back by your companion. They are telling you things that you know to yourself that you could do. But they are telling you you cannot do it. Stop condemning people for what they do. You do not know what God has in store for them. It may, not, it may not be your forte. It may not be what you like or what you want. But your calling and my calling is different. Your way of life and my way of life with God is different. Understand that what God could do with you, he, I can't do it. God know exactly what you are troubled with. And some of you who are listening to me now are deeply troubled. Deeply troubled about the mortgage to pay, about studies, about university. Badly troubled about your health. Badly troubled about how would you pay the bills the end of the month. As a matter of fact, how are you paying the bus tomorrow morning? You're troubled about how you're getting breakfast. And some of you are wondering and thinking in your head. You left home this morning and you're trying to figure out what you could put together when you go home to get lunch. Doubt is a dangerous thing. I mean, James said, when, when a doubting man is well like a ship on a sea without a rudder. The reason why some of you are drifting on the open ocean of life, you are doubters. You're doubting too much. You're doubting your own self. What? When you know what God has asked you to do, do not allow people to take you apart. 